Well, probably when you hear a school assignment with the words utopian, dystopian, futurism, mm. you might be thinking that's for high schoolers. But actually, it turns out that's not quite the case. Absolutely. Some pretty fancy words. Instead <laughs> of an elementary school art class is exploring what those fancy words and complex themes mean. Here's Morning Insider, Lauren Victory. Jesse White Learning Academy students waited months for this moment. The final results of an assignment like no other. Design sneakers that represent history or the future. No way. Before we show you the winners, a little backstory about art class at this school. This is going to look flat and this will look textured. Teacher Ben Salas wants his kindergartners through eighth graders to understand concepts like color theory, but he also challenges them to think critically. Everything that my students are working on, even if it's clay projects or self-portraits, uh, the collages that we've done, they're all based on memories and narratives. Like this new mural of masked faces, sure, it's a permanent reminder of pandemic pain. Um, that is your silhouette behind you, right? Yes. But co-creator Marlena Angelo wants you to look closer to see positive messages too. To make people like like be more proud of themselves and like make them stand up if they're like feeling down. Salas's sneaker assignment rewarded symbolism with custom painted Air Jordans. See how far you can take your ideas. From a tribute to Black Lives Matter to a shout out to the Simpsons future predicting and a nod to the short but sweet life of cherry blossoms. In the future, if all the oceans are gone, I can be a marine biologist. Zaria Best's message about commercial overfishing wasn't one professional artist and sneaker painter Anthony Amos expected from a fifth grader. You guys came up with something pretty dope. Dope and deep. In Hazelcrest, Lauren Victory, CBS 2 News. That is dope. Next up for the art class, creating custom mugs using the pottery kiln to cut down on cup waste. The Morning Insiders first told you about this unique sneaker contest last year. Remember seeing that? A nice follow-up here. You could check out that original story on our website, cbschicago.com. And also for more stories like this from Lauren and the Morning Insiders, download the CBS Chicago app and click on that Morning Insiders tab.